I'm so tired. <laughs> but it is time for me to go get ready and then I'll come back here and brush my teeth. Time to get ready. This is my little mirror. <laughs> oh, I just pinged my elbow. Okay, so yeah, this is where I like brush my hair and like put on bare minimum makeup. Cause you know, we'll be running out of the hospital all day long. So who wants to, I'm mad props to the people that can wear a whole full face cause it cannot be me, sorry. But mad respect for you. Okay, so now I like put on all my stuff. So like, I have my studs. Oh, I just dropped that. Okay, so this coat and then um, my mask. I mean my mask, my goggles. Um, I always carry a little um, a notebook to like take quick notes. I'll put that in there. Little pockets, and then ha, please ignore my towel hanging up to dry. Um, then I have my pen. Put that over here. And then my pen light. And then um, I have my name badge, so I have it. I'm gonna put it this way. Oh my gosh, yeah. So I have to put it on backwards. Um, yeah, I definitely have to fix that. And then um, you have your tape scissors. And then my mask, which every time we leave, we get a new mask to put on for when we're going there. So um, I have to put this one. But I'm gonna go put this on and go to the bathroom and brush my teeth. So, oh, and I already put deodorant on um and i can't put perfume on because it might be sensitive to the um the um, patients so we'll just stick with deodorant um so i catch up with y'all in the bathroom okay, brush my teeth. So now that I brushed my teeth, um, I'm gonna go back in my room. I put on my um, nursing jacket and I grab a snack. And then I, by this point, I have to head to our little um, motor pool um, public safety office and then get the keys and stuff. So check back with y'all soon. turn the camera around okay so um right now actually we have a policy right now that they lifted um where we're allowed to wear a mask outside um i'm just choosing to wear mine um i don't know sometimes it's cold out here it's actually really this is the first time i've walked out from nicole and it hasn't been like 30 degrees outside so i'm very thankful for that and basically i'm just walking to our um sleepo and that's where our public safety office is and then i'm gonna get the keys but as you can see, I'm like the only one up right now. Um, this is our president's house. <laughs> um, and so luckily, I'm so thankful because compared to other people, they don't have, they have to walk all the way across campus. And mine's just like right up here. It's like right over there. So we're very thankful for that. So um, I'll kind of show you like kind of what the process looks like. If I can get it on video, I don't think I can, but um, so I just picked up my keys and our cleaning supplies and usually I would come over here to this little printer and we have clinical paperwork we have to do. Um, let me go inside. Yeah, so we have clinical paperwork we have to usually do. So um, usually I would go and print it off, but this week my um, instructor told us that we do not have to do that. So I'm like, but less, cause um, I just see myself sometimes I'm trying not to get my badge in here. Um, so yeah, I just got the cleaning supplies and the keys to the vehicle. Um, and so basically I come down these steps and find the vehicle. And I have a special way of doing it. Um, I just figured out I could have done this last week instead of like searching for the vehicle I have. So yay for this. So y'all just wait to be amazed. <laughs> so all the way down there is my vehicle. Yay! My new whip or van. Let me get comfortable. So I start by first getting in the vehicle and putting the seat all the way back because, um, yeah, I'm pretty tall. <laughs> um, and then I have to start the vehicle. Um, 
and usually have to start and then for the motor pool we have to record the before and after mileage so um, i usually get them up my pen and then just fill that out real fast so let's just do that oh i can't see from the camera huh. it out and then I usually just put it back in the wall that they give us so okay, and now I just kind of undo my work and I put all of my stuff in my bag I brought um this is just so like I don't lose it in the car or it falls like underneath seats and stuff so um, we'll just take everything off except for usually my um, um badge and my goggles will be fine and of course you have to wear your mask like, um so I'll have to leave my mask on um and then just put everything in the bag and at this point, um, I kind of get ready to go pick up my friend, um, and then, yeah, so I'm just gonna, like, turn on the AC and crank the music and get ready, so I'll be back, y'all, yeah, like soon. Y'all can see me very well. Um, but Ozzy's about to come, and she'll, like, get in the vehicle and make sure the door's unlocked so she can get in. And basically, um, I kind of just put the directions in, and we drive straight there, so stay tuned. Hi guys, so we made it to the hospital, me and Ozzy. We're just like kind of relaxing a little bit but before we go in. But the hospital's over there, but I can't show the name because, you know, privacy reasons. But, um, thanks. Okay, so now we're walking into the hospital with my friends, so. Clinical is over. <laughs> Y'all, um, so I'm finally back at our school and my day it was interesting. It was definitely never a day I've experienced before, but I'm very thankful I experienced it so I can like learn from it and know that like this is not always the case, but not everything is always like you know easy. So um yeah, I'm just, I can't thank the Lord enough for what he's uh, gotten me through today. So yeah, um, this is where I end the vlog. Um, usually I would go get food, um, like through a drive through but I have to go shower. If you understand, if you're a nurse, you understand, like got to, like cannot not shower. So um, I'm going to shower and then um, my boyfriend's actually coming over and um, he's going to bring me food. So shout out to Noe. Love you. Um, so here we are. This is the end. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. I wish I could take the um, YouTube video and put it... I mean, I wish I could take my phone and my camera into the hospital, but it's not allowed. So, But I just thank you guys for watching and for supporting me as a nurse. So if you know a nurse in your life, go reach out to them. Shout out. Like, go give them so much praise. Especially, like, the CNAs and, like, nursing students, RNAs. RN, sorry, RNs, LPNs, go shout out a nurse today because, or home, home nurses, home health nurses, oh, much respect for nurses, nurses, so that's all I have for today, um, all right, peace be with you guys.